Konstantin Kalimnik is a Russian political operative with ties to various people who served on President Trump's 2016 campaign. He was indicted by special counsel Robert Mueller in 2018, and his name has continued to surface in court documents and transcripts. Here are three things to know about Konstantin Kalimnik. First, Kalimnik is a longtime associate of Paul Manafort, President Trump's former campaign chairman. The two worked together for years, consulting for Ukrainian politicians, and Kalimnik ran Manafort's office in Kiev. There, the two men also worked alongside Rick Gates, a former Trump advisor, who pleaded guilty to conspiring with Manafort to commit crimes and to acting as an unregistered agent of a foreign power. He's cooperating with the special counsel. According to Mueller's team, Kalimnik met with Manafort multiple times in the U.S. after Manafort became Trump's campaign chairman. One of those meetings came just days after Manafort was asked about his connections to Russia. Are there any ties between Mr. Trump, you or your campaign, and Putin and his regime? No, there are not. It's absurd uh, and, you know, there's no basis to it. On August 2, 2016, Manafort met Kalimnik in New York and gave him private polling data, something Manafort's attorneys inadvertently revealed in a court filing. The two men also discussed a Ukrainian peace plan, which may have involved lifting sanctions on Russia. In December, the special counsel said Manafort had lied repeatedly about his interactions with Kalimnik. And in February, prosecutors said those interactions went to the heart of the special counsel's investigation. However, neither Manafort nor Kalimnik have been charged with crimes related to those meetings. Secondly, Kalimnik allegedly has ties to Russian intelligence, according to the special counsel's office. In a sealed hearing in February, prosecutors said exactly that. And in a separate filing last year, they were even more specific, saying that Kalimnik, named there as Person A, had such ties in 2016. Kalimnik has previously said that he once worked as a language instructor for Russia's Military Institute of Foreign Languages, but he has denied any connections to Russian intelligence. And third, Kalimnik has been indicted alongside Manafort for obstructing justice in a case unrelated to the 2016 election. Prosecutors said that the two men knowingly and intentionally sought to influence the testimony of witnesses who could have been called to testify at Manafort's second trial in Washington last year. Manafort faced charges of conspiring against the United States, conspiring to launder money, and failing to register as an agent of a foreign power. He later pleaded guilty to some of those charges. Kalimnik remains at large and is believed to be in Russia.